Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I am back with another video and the last time as you guys may or may not know I did start a poll on the community section of YouTube. So it was kind of this post where I asked you guys if you guys wanted to see my favorite stickers and sticker shops or if you guys wanted to see my sticker collection slash organization and you guys wanted to see the other one first. So if you guys would like to check out my favorite stickers and sticker shops I will go ahead and put a little card up here. That that video went up last week so I wanted to go ahead and get this video up for you guys as well because you guys were very interested in seeing both of these videos I am going to go ahead and just warn you from the beginning my organization for now is not the best and I definitely want to improve it but I decided to not do it yet because I want to go ahead and just give you guys basically a raw collection and organization video first and then maybe do an organization video with you guys so me actually organizing all of my stickers on camera and just talking to you guys I think that would be a really good fun thing to do so that's why I decided to just bring out all of my stickers and where I have them as they are so these are most of the stickers that I could find I do have other really really old stickers that I when I started planning which was back in I believe anywhere from 2015 to 2016 so I do have pretty old stickers in this collection just a fair warning so some of these stickers you guys are not going to be able to still get but some of them you still can't so I'll, like, I'll go ahead and let you guys know which ones you can and which ones you can't uh, I'll also go ahead and link all the shops that I have down below just because Especially if you guys liked any of these stickers and want to go ahead and buy them for yourself. So let's go ahead and get started. First and foremost, I want to go ahead and talk about these stickers because these are some of my all-time favorite stickers and therefore in my collection. These are the Erin Condren sort of sticker sheets that you have right here and these are worth three dollars a piece i love these stickers for my budget videos as you guys have seen them as well as just to decorate some of my note pages and as well as these are just the sticker books that i always talk about on my channel i don't have a particular way of storing these so they're just like out and about <laughs> in one of my craft drawers so i do want to go ahead and sort of get a setup that will have these stickers in order so I am still thinking about how I'm going to go ahead and put these in order but if you guys are interested in purchasing these stickers from Erin Condren I always have two links down below one of them is to get $10 off your first Erin Condren purchase and the other ones are just affiliate links that will just give me a bit of kickback if you guys purchase anything from the Erin Condren website using those links so these are the first stickers I just wanted to go ahead and show you guys even though I don't really have an organization for them so these are it then next i'm going to go ahead and start with i think these more organized ones maybe yeah pretty i'm gonna start with the more organized so i have talked about these you guys would have seen my favorite sticker stickers video you guys would have probably seen these but these i just have in cute little photo albums that I got from Michaels. These are just the recollections photo albums. These are the 4.7 by 6.4. If you guys are interested, they're both just the same exact thing. I just took out the cover. So we're going to go ahead and start with this one. You guys probably already saw this one, but this is from um, all these stickers are from Once More With Love. So we have we have a bunch of bucket lists here, then the anniversary favorites here and here. Most of these stickers are well loved. You guys are going to be able to see because I really love Once More With Love stickers. We have some Amazon ones, some Payday ones, some beer ones. <laughs> I still use this all the time. Um, some drunk ones, Pokemon Go ones, hiking ones. These are working out ones. Cheat day, um, if you're happy and you know it, sticker sheet. Then we have the FaceTime one. I really love these ones. Then we have kind of these like emotion munchkin stickers. And these are just what they're called. These little cuties are called munchkins. Then we have kind of like the sad ones or not having a good day. Then the friends. And these are budding and cork. I don't think she has them at her shop anymore. This is sort of like a debut um, exclusive. But I don't think she actually brought them out. Or maybe she just stopped bringing them out. These are the film, edit, and upload stickers. I bought so many of these for YouTube. These are the bookworm ones, the pizza ones, tacos, YouTube binge, Netflix binge. These are the movie stickers, date night, more date night, and kind of like date ideas. Then we have some cookie ones, some baking ones, ice cream, pool ones. These I use whenever I dye my hair. Then some eyebrow ones. 
some road trip ones, um, some traveling ones, and I recently just found this one in one of my other folders. These are the no spend stickers, which I definitely have to use <laughs> in my planner more often. So this was it. I really like this organization. So this is probably the most organized as it gets for me and my sticker collection so far. So this one's it. Then I do have this other photo album sticker, and I'm gonna go ahead and start from the back because these are still once more with love stickers. We have the Thank God It's Friday, the In a Hurry ones, Raining, these are the Pumpkin Spice Latte ones, Doctor's Appointment, I just have one habit tracker there. This is the Birthday Countdown, which I only have a couple more stickers left, and then this is a graduation countdown that I used for my sister's graduation two years ago. Then I have some work ones, I just have like I think two of these, these are kind of like the eating ones there i'm sorry i'm going pretty fast i just have a lot of stickers to show you guys then we have these youtube dot ones from carolina's crafts these are from scribble prince co i don't think she has them at her shop anymore i think she does kind of different things i think she's she's more on the foil stickers now but i bought these a long time ago this is a deluxe freebie from glam planner for a while from a while ago but i thought i'd keep it because um I, they're so checklist I have a ch another checklist from Scribble Prince Co. This is in old September colors, I believe. Then we have some Glam Planner ones. And these I actually got from Glam Planner's first advent calendar, which I believe was also two years ago. So this is where I got these. I don't I haven't really used this much. Probably just like a couple of stickers, but these are cute. They're tiny. Then I have these, which are also very, very old. These are kind of like the breakfast brunch stickers and we have some coffee ones these are some laundry baskets from caress press then we have some very cute designs um, target bags this is a freebie from a sale that once more with love was having i've only used one of these stickers but they're really cute these are iced coffees from the monsters co we have some weekend banners from one of my all-time favorite shops stick with me shop um, some makeup stickers. I don't think I have any more. No, these are some gas stickers. I used to love her stickers. I don't think she restocks as much or I don't think she restocks these stickers, but I really like them. These are some weather ones, some tidying up, cleaning ones, some shopping ones, lazy day ones, some scale ones, sushi, some cute sweets, checklists. These are some weekly spending trackers. And I actually just found some of these stick with me shop stickers in one of these. I'm just gonna take them out because I just remembered. But I I don't have any more room in these photo albums, so I might just have to get another photo album. But I also got these cute workout stickers and this eating out sticker. So you have like lunch date and dinner dates and just a, cute, a bunch of cute ones. I've used so many of these. And this is the study one. This is just some cute little post-its, some important stickers that look just like the workout stickers, as you guys can see. Then some reading flags. This is a freebie from Fox and Cactus. This is a freebie from Chasing Chels, which I just started buying from. I really like her stickers. I've already used two of these. Um, I think this was a very generous sampler. Then we have some very cute designs, old formatted stickers. These are the YouTube ones, some Facebook ones. And these are one of more of her new ones. I bought these recently. These are class ones, homework ones, which I love, and some Instagram and YouTube. So that is that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and go into I'm gonna go ahead and go really fast. So I have this folder. It's like dirty and with like a sticker here. I just found this. I just found this and I have not used this in so long. But I'm going to show you guys because this is a mess. So I used to buy a lot of Scroll Prince Co. kits. So this is just pretty much not scraps because I can definitely do more um, plan with me's with these. But I just don't have the vertical life planner anymore. So I might be doing a giveaway with those. Especially these. Like I have a whole sheet of just tv stickers that i can possibly give away so i'll probably do that when i do my organization video so stay tuned for that i have some flags then i have these two cute stickers from this shop called obsessed with cute i haven't 
bought from her in a while so i'm not sure if she still has a shop open but these are her date night ones and these are the kind of um, no coffee no worky ones i've loved coffee for so long guys it's crazy um then i have i'm just gonna take these out there some old stickers from glam planner so there we have the christmas ones these are from clever crafts designs these are kind of like christmas errands shopping holiday shopping and all of that then we have some of her birthday countdowns i did not finish that birthday countdown how sad is that <laughs> then these are just really old samplers so this is from caress press this is an old february sticker from scribble prince co old easter sticker these are some wacky holidays from 2017 guys from once more with love that i never used so i'll sure be using that in this year this is just i can probably throw this away if we're being honest but i'm just kind of a no sticker left behind kind of gal so that's why i never threw that out and i have some like leftover stickers here and these are from february and december so i might be able to use these lost ones right here <laughs> I always say that and I never end up using them, which is the saddest part ever. I also do have this pumpkin spice sticker from KPO Plants, which I could probably put in my other... I'm just going to put this on the side because I can put it in the other ones. Then just a lot of, of other scraps, as you guys can... Not scraps, but just stickers that I'm probably never going to use. I have quite a lot of stickers from the same colors because I would be that kind of gal i would buy everything in the same color um for the month it's just so i can match everything and these are just kind of film edit upload stickers that she had a long time ago then some of these like month she used to do these monthly stickers were on top of the calendars checklists more of those <laughs> stickers i used to buy from glam planner as well as scribble prints co a lot as you guys can tell these are nothing but Glam Planner and Scribble Friends Co. I was obsessed. Oh, I love this one. This is, I think, I think this was from a May subscription, um, from her sticker subscription from Glam Planner. I don't even know how I remember that, but I do. Uh, then we have some more flags, little things, and these are from, what are these from? Planning Faith, which I actually... There's just like a couple of stickers. So that's why I never threw them away because I could definitely use these. Especially because I had her personal back then. And then these other ones are from um, Leia Darling. I believe that's how you say it. I just have a lot of scraps. Let me take these out. Okay. And we have these. I'm just going to take all of them out. Because why not, right? And some right here. Oh my god. Now, I got this one from a Beautycon box. I didn't even know they had stickers, but these are just what they look like. They're from the Angel and Shayla collab, I think. This was from a long time ago, but that's that. Then Victoria's Secret sent me some stickers, so I put it in there. Then I had some full boxes from Carolina's Crafts that I was going to use when I went to New York, but then I found something better to use. But So I still have these. I could probably give those away. Then I have some kind of scraps from this the planning co these are just a peppermint mocha full boxes and a bunch of other things then i have these that i don't know if i'm ever going to use so i might just keep these away in my organization video that i'll have too i'm quite a mess right now guys <laughs> wait until you see the other stickers okay so then we have just these other stickers that i have that i don't really use to be honest more of those headers these are from Obsessed with Cute as well. I used to love using these big cakes. Then some more leftover stickers that I can probably still use or give away. Oh look, these go with the peppermint mocha ones. Let's put those with that. Yeah, lots of stickers that I'm not using anymore. And then I have some more of these birthday little things from Scribble Friends Co. I have two sheets of these. And then I have these from Giraffes on Skates. These are the medical ones and I have the credit card ones as well. I don't use these because these are supposed to be for the Erin Condren vertical planner length. So that's why I don't use them. I don't have that planner anymore. So I really don't have use for them at this point. Then some credit card ones. And I think this shop, it doesn't even exist anymore. I think I try to look it up. I have one random full box in here. I don't know, guys. I'm stressed. And then just a lot of freebies. Keep your plans. Scribble Prince Co. Then the 
this is when I got my first order from Fox and Cactus. This is from Sweet Kawaii Design <laughs> from May 2016. Okay, guys, I need to de stash ASAP. Um, then, once again, these are the Glam Planner. These are from, let me just put these aside. These are from, once again, from the advent calendar she had. So, I have these cute shopping bags, grocery bags. This is from, I believe, one of her subscription sticker boxes. Advent calendar, advent calendar. So just a lot of stickers. This is from the Clever Girl Crafts. I could have used these for this fall. Let me put this on the side. I could probably still use it. Okay. And then I have some Scribble Prince Co. Nail polishes. These are old. Then I got some Leo Darling ones. I think these are cute because I love my Keurig. So whenever I have to clean it or get new K-Cups, I get those. I totally forgot I had these. And these I bought. I didn't buy them actually. They came with my order. I bought, I think, a Star Wars kit and it just came with that so that's that that i'm probably never going to use then look we have some more of those movie slates then i just have some freebies from carolina's crafts okay guys these are my first ever stickers that i purchased they are from hello ashley ann i remember l fowler which is the creator of glam planner talked about these and i went ahead and bought them as soon as i could so that's that then more obsessed with cute stickers these are just the final ones tiny birthday cakes i have two sheets of those actually um time to plan edit these are some cocktail stickers from carolina's crafts then i have some fox and cactus this is the summer bucket list or something like that i have some scribblers st patrick scribbler and then easter scribblers and then this is a covers two full boxes or it used to this is from glam planners one of glam planners sticker kit stickers and we have this one from the admin calendar more of these headers from scribble prince co some headers from my own island i used to use these a lot these are for youtube some drink it up stickers from sweet go wide designs i have like three sheets of these and i never ended up using the last one this is just one of glam planners first freebies then we have some balloons from Scribble Prince Co. More of those cute little sheets from Glam Planner. I actually bought this. I have no clue. Oh, I actually know why I bought this wedding sticker. It was because she was having a sale on everything. And I don't know why I thought that I was going to go to some wedding. I think I was going to go to a wedding, but I just totally forgot that I had these. So I never got to use them. Then I got these cute mermaid stickers and some birthday cake numbered stickers. Then I have more of a mess in here. <laughs> I'm kind of like anxious right now. I have more of these just scraps basically. This is from the Stick With Me. Stick With Me, which is the Stick With Me shop. And I forgot what other shop was in collaboration. But then I just have some other ones. These shops, I don't know if they're still... I know this one is not because I think I looked it up. But I have quite a bit of stickers that I can possibly still use. I even have this planning faith and I don't think I'm ever going to use it because like I said I don't have a vertical planner anymore so I can go ahead and give that away in my d-stash as well so if you guys would like to see a whole sticker organization video of like me actually organizing the stickers to my new setup then go ahead and comment down below and give this video a big thumbs up then I have these emoji stickers uh, I think my sister gave me I haven't used these yet, but hopefully I will soon. Then this is just a lot of scraps. I got these little cute things from, I think, where did I get them? I got them from 99 cents. Oh, I got them from Goodwill. That's where I got these. I got like three of these. They're just really cute to put like pictures and the kids fit perfectly in there. So that's why I got them. So then this is just a lot of scrap that I'm probably not going to go over unless I go over it in the giveaway video. But this is just from really old kits. And I just set them up by all of the colors. So I can probably do a whole week's worth of planning with these just because I have so many of like kind of the same colors. Look guys, I have a full sheet of half boxes there. Some headers and then it changes. I have like one, just one full box, but I just kept it there. Like I said, I am a no sticker left behind kind of gal. So I have just, oh, I just separated them by like colors and what I thought would look good. So that if I didn't have a kit for a week, then I can go ahead and do that. I got both of these sheets from a, 
I think it was like a grab bag, but I don't have anything else to match with those. Some weekend banners. These are a lot of different Scribble Prints Go and Plum Planner items. Like I said, it's all I used to purchase in the past. There's some more right here. I'm just going over these really quick. I actually have these full boxes that I never used that were older June colors. So I can go ahead and give those away too. I feel like this video is like 40 minutes long. <laughs> then we have some of these. I'm just probably not going to go over Oh my god, this was like one of the cutest patterns ever The Scribble Prince Co. had. The donuts one. Who remembers that? If you remember that, you're definitely an OG to Scribble Prince Co. <laughs> but this is just what that looks like. I have a lot too that I can do still. This is for my birthday one that I did the first time I had a planner and then just like new years and then just stuff that I could probably all match together that I kept as you guys can see because I could probably use those I just didn't realize that I had all of this until like I'm actually like looking for it if you guys know what I mean this is just kind of like the older setup for her um, samplers as you guys can see I have so many these are glitter headers from carolina's crafts which i still have a lot of i just don't have really any use for this like i said because i don't have the vertical planner this year so that was what was in here then the other one that i have is a little less scrappy well i think it's still like as uh, scrappy but there's a couple of full kits and they're like also giveaway and there's not that many stickers in here so there's this one i'm so sorry this is so long if you guys are still here with me let me know comment down below because i know it's a long one um i have some i don't know this is from like a butterfly kit then just grabs from this fox and cactus birthday kit well i can probably give this away too yeah somebody can use that i don't know what that is oh i still had some of these okay that's why i kept that oh and these two okay i definitely understand why i kept all of this now then this is from i think one of her thanksgiving kits then look i have more of those september color headers this is more of the thanksgiving kit thanksgiving kit and this is from a glam planner i'm not sure I, that's all i have then i have these personal sticker kit from Brittany and design so i have this one that i never ended up using i bought these for my personal planner and i just never used them and then i have this other christmasy one so i'll probably do a giveaway for these pretty soon so let me know if you guys want to see my whole sticker organization video so i can go ahead and get that up for you guys next then i do have both of these are full sticker kits actually this is a mini kit but this is a full sticker kit that i never ended up using which is actually really sad of course, Scribble Print School since then has changed the whole format, but this is a full mini kit back in the day. I was going to use this when I went to the Orange County Fair, but I never ended up using it. I'm not sure why. I don't quite remember, but this is just what it looks like. So full boxes, kind of like the sampler, half boxes and little things, washi and deco, and look at this. Guys, I even bought some glitter headers. I am crazy. I know I am. <laughs> like I said in the past, I used to spend so much money on stickers. So there's that. <laughs> and then this was one of Blam Planner's subscription stickers, sticker kits. So this was the deco, then sampler, some half boxes, some full boxes. This, is, this was kind of like a camping one. It's really cute. Some heart checklists some headers and back back when she used to have her matte washi i'm not sure if she has matte washi anymore i haven't bought a kit from glam planner in a while just because your girl's been on a budget so <laughs> okay so that is all for the grabby things from my planner now last but not least i'm going to show you guys this mini binder that i have i actually got this mini binder from target these are the only stickers that are pretty much organized and worth waiting for um for the whole video i'm so sorry about the other ones but i definitely want to go ahead and get a couple more of these and organize all of my stickers or at least the stickers that i'm going to use and binders like these so this is just the green room one inch binder 
and I got this from Target like I said and I have this is basically where I put all the stickers that I am using or I will want to use so I have my budget stickers by Erin Condren, which I use all the time. I have two sheets of those, and I have the traveling ones, which I will be using when I go to Peru. I have some dot ones from Nicole Hutch Designs, some pencils from Carolina's Crafts, some cute little pencils with writing from KPL Plants. These are some other school stickers. Some school checklists from Scribble Prince Co. These are OG. Too. Well, actually not. They're not as old as the other stickers that I had from them, but this is the old Scribble Prints called Writing. Then I have some reading stickers by A Happy Boo Tree. These are new stickers that I bought from Chasing Chels, and we have some post-its. These are the chores one, the self-care, which I really like, Netflix binge, and coffee mix. Then we have some Disney stickers from KPL Plan, so these are just the Zoom Zooms. And right here we have some mini ears. I have some working out stickers from A Happy Blue Tree. And these are some running stickers. I don't think that shop exists anymore. So that's why I'm not going to label it or anything. Some Bible study stickers from KPL Plans. Some drinks with friends from Carolina's Crafts. More, um, some scallop labels. I've rarely used these and I've had them for so long. So I might just use stash those too. Some utility stickers. These are really old from Glam Planner too, but I thought I would just keep them here because there's different colors. So I can use them whenever. Some colorful half boxes from Glam Planner. These are some breakfast stickers from My Happy Boot Tree. Some ramen stickers. These are, I think I bought these this year actually because I needed them. There are some Instagram stickers, cell phone, junk food stickers. These are from Plant to Plant Sticker Co some gas stickers and then these are the sort of travel the world stickers I was talking about in my last video from once more with love these are the Venice ones the Mexico ones and then last but not least I have the Las Vegas ones then these are just some fox and cactus stickers that I have this is the junk food one some grocery shopping ones some emotion ones laundry these are the exercising ones, as well as these in the back. I've never used these of lifting weights because this is definitely not me. And this is the other, the Coffee Monster Skull sticker that I have, which is the Emoji Favorite Sampler. I don't have anything in the back, so I could probably put something there. Then I have some stickers from the Pumpkin Planner Co. I just like them because she had red hair, so it reminded me of me. And then we have some Emotion ones, which I haven't used that much. I just haven't been in the groove to plan that much, but I am starting to get back on it, so I'm excited. These are the Sweet Kawaii Designs Boba stickers. These are the makeup brushes one, and these are the juice one. I use these for whenever I make green juice in the morning. Then we have some Scribble Prince Co. Scribblers, and then these are old as well. These are kind of like appointment labels. One of those um, three checklists to cleans. These are all build dues from Scribble Prince Co. and from Polka Dot Plants. I'm not sure if this is an actual shop still anymore. These are so old, oh my god, but I used to love these so much. I have so many of these. Um, they're timed dots. These are so cute. These are movie marquees from Glam Planner. These are to pack lists from a Happy Blue Tree. I kept that there so I knew which one it was. Then some flight info trackers from KPL Plants. Some appointment half boxes some icons then i just have some like cleaning ones right here and some really old ones against google prints code that i can probably put with the other scrap ones so yeah and then more just scraps from old scribble prints co's kits and then last but not least we have this chore stickers from clever gal crafts and i have two more of these i'm going to go ahead and buy more of these sheet protectors because i really like how i have this whole thing organized i definitely need to organize all of these other stickers it's, it's just a mess right now but i really hope you guys enjoyed if you guys stayed until the end i definitely applaud you guys thank you so much for sitting until the end and seeing my whole sticker collection i know it's quite a mess but i am excited to make a video showing you guys just how i'm going to go ahead and organize it 
and what stickers I'm going to de-stash to give to you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below if you guys would like to see that organization video and would like to win any of these stickers just so I can know to make the video. As well as if you have any questions about any of the shops that I mentioned or any stickers or anything like that, go ahead and comment that down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you guys are not subscribed already and Tap on that notification bell just so you guys can get notifications whenever I upload a new video. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys. You and I, we're always on the edge. We fight and make love at the same time. Would you break up just because I told you?